number six. The following data represent the age in weeks at which babies first crawl based on a 12-month survey, based on the survey of 12 mothers. Data are normally distributed. S is 10.329 weeks. We're going to do a 90% confidence interval and interpret uh, the results. So, grab stat crunch. We're going to go stat, variance, one sample, summary. Now, this is standard deviation, so just remember, so I'm doing this work with the calculator, but the relationship between S, which is standard deviation, and variance, which is S squared, is squaring the variance. And if you want to go backwards, you would do the square root. So it would be square root of S squared, which is variance, equals the standard deviation. So I'm doing the stat crunch with the variance and then we just take the square root of it to get the standard deviation. So we we'll ask for the sample variance. We're given the sample standard deviation. So first we need to square that number. Sample size was 12. Confidence interval 90%. Alright, so this gives us <coughs> a confidence interval for the variance. So this is a uh, 59.647392. That is less than sigma squared, which is less than the upper limit, 256. Again, to go from variance to standard deviation, we just take the square root, and then this will give me a confidence interval. That's the relationship between variance and standard deviation. This will give me a confidence interval for um, standard deviation, which is what it's asking. <laughs> yeah, confidence interval for the population standard deviation. So, we are going to do the square root of 59.647392. And we're going to round that to three decimal places. 90% confidence we're between point or 7.723 and then the upper limit I do the square root of the 256 5 2 8 66 16 0 1 7 16.017 